Yeah, I don't know if you can quite get the scope of this in a picture. This is called sedum. It grows around here pretty good in Kennewick. We propagated it. It grows all along the hills here. This hill right here by the house. And you can see the normal end of one. They all look like this in the 25, well, 15 years for sure that we had it growing around here and over 20 at another place. I have never seen a head look like that. Never. And I've seen a lot of sedum growing in this country. Over. Got here in 71, so long history. Never saw something like that. Not once. Not ever. There's a my hand, there's a comparison. Looks like a, a total mutation on the end. Look how flat it is and broad. They're not. They're tubular. They're a tubular plant. See? They tubular all the way up. This one just said, oh, fuck, what happened? And turned sideways. That's amazing. Thank you, Fukushima. And Hanford and everybody else. But Fukushima was the straw that broke the camel's back. You can see here, so I've got a lot of it. I weed through it, so I'm in it all the time. See, there's a weed there. i got to get that one. See? I weed it, because if I don't, they'll come along and spray it, because it's along a road. If I don't keep it up, they'll just spray the whole damn mess out. So, yeah, that was the wildest thing. I took some pictures, and I just it couldn't do it justice, man. That is a trip. There's the normal sedum with the trees and stuff. i got to cut out of it to grow through it neighbor's mailbox but yeah check it out that's the normal deal unbelievable huh? yeah that's the wow. so you can see see them going all over I try to promote any natural growth like Russian olives the sage blue sage and the ash trees that blow in I just pick the ones I want to grow and rip out the rest. Anyway, I thought that was pretty interesting.